It's time for the defense to present its case. It's just a day after the jury heard from the medical examiner saying a toddler was shaken so hard blood got on her brain. Yeah, Benjamin Brown took the stand in his own defense late this afternoon on the felony murder charge from the 2018 death of Annie Shell. News 12 Scott Coral watched it all unfold. He has tonight's top local story. After three forensic pathologists testified about the injuries of two-year-old Annie Shell, it became time for the defendant, Benjamin Brown, to take the stand. Once the prosecution got a hold of him, the fireworks began. I like Detective Elrod. We all know I did. I mean... I'm not talking about Detective Elrod. Do you not understand what I'm asking? You're asking me if I lied about the time, and I did to Detective Elrod. No, I'm asking you if you lied to the jury today about the time. I'm sorry, I don't I know how to make it any clearer. Several times, the prosecuting attorney pressed Brown about lying to a detective on the scene of the crime, lying on the stand, and his own inconsistent testimony. So you lied to Detective Elrod, right? We all know, yes, sir. Okay. And then you told Steve and Brown that you didn't remember. Yes, sir. So when you told Stephen Brown... But I do believe I did tell Stephen Brown that she was gone two hours and 24 minutes since I've been in here on trial. Okay. So when you told Stephen Brown you didn't remember, you were lying. To my knowledge, I really, I really wasn't keeping up with how long she was gone. The prosecution is expected to call more rebuttal witnesses on Saturday. The judge expects the case to go to the jury by the end of the day. At the Criminal Courts Building, Scott Coral, News 12 Now.